For the latest loops and scoops, subscribe to Nagi, the Dan Avi. Work like scum. Welcome back to the channel, my viewers and subscribers. Yeah. And as most of you know, know already, a male nursing assistant at the Noel Holmes Hospital in Anova is now in police custody in relation to allegations that he um, um, sexually assaulted a child who had been admitted. And me even have a voice note my viewers and subscribers of the 15 year old. You see me? Letting us know what took place. But before, let me gonna hear what she had to say. This is what the news article is stating. The 15 year old patient was admitted for a drug overdose allegedly after being sexually abused by a family member. So the community like says, yo, she, she jump out of a, a frying pan and land in a fire, my viewers and subscribers. Anyways, in a tweet today, Health Minister Dr. Christopher Tufton called the situation most distressing. The minister said he had he has been in touch with the family and has also ordered an internal investigation. In the meantime, the mother of the 15-year-old child told the gleaner that the girl is in emotional turmoil. She said the child has been crying a lot. She didn't get an opportunity to speak about the first incident to open up to us, but now she knows we will listen. She is opening up, the mother said. The hospital assault reportedly happened shortly before midnight Friday. The teen was admitted on Wednesday. Following the alleged hospital assault, the child's mother discharged her from the facility without the perm permission of doctors. In the first place, a male nurse assistant shouldn't be on a female ward, said the, th the teen's mother. And as my viewers, I have a little clip in. A five minute voice note of the 15 year old talking about what transpired. So check it out. And draw your own conclusion. On Wednesday, May 19th, I was admitted to the Newell Homes Lucy Hospital after attempting suicide because I had kept a secret about being molested five years ago. It was getting to me and I was not sure of how my parents would react when I tell them. So I try to keep it to myself. After being admitted on the female general ward, where I was placed under supervision of a nurse. I was again molested by a worker there, a male nurse's assistant. I was sleeping when I felt the person rubbing my private part. When I felt this, I shift and I heard the person saying, calm down. When I realized that it was a male voice, I had a panic attack. By this time, the person had moved. I did not look to see who it was because I did not want to know because I became scared. After turning around while I'm still having a panic attack, another patient who was beside me on another bed saw that I was having a panic attack and called for a nurse. When the nurse came to me, I asked her to get the nurse that was responsible for me. When she arrived, she asked me what had happened. 
and I told her. She asked me if I saw the person, and I said no. But I heard the person say something, so she asked if I heard the voice. Would I be able to identify it? When all the nurses came in, because they were all trying to figure out what was wrong, I then heard the person come in asking, what is wrong with her? So I looked up and I saw the person because I had identified the voice. I then realized who it was. The nurse took me out to her vehicle and this is where she was asking me questions. There is where I confessed that I knew who it was. After all of that, I was informed that I was not the first that this had happened to. And what I really want is, I know I'm not the first, but I want to be the last. If I'm not the first, why is this person still working at the hospital? If I am not the first, why is it still continuing? I want to be the last. I want this to never happen to another patient at the Lucy Hospital again. The only thing that keeps pushing me is the fact that I want to be the last. I want this to end. Let me be the last. And does not hear my viewers that I will take place and for who did I listen keenly the girl said she was molested five years ago many of you probably wonder why she never did talk from them time there but you have a thing what they call victim shaming you see what I say no jokes about it you have some people they free to come out and come come talk what they go through you see what I say my viewers are subscribers so that's why more while them bit near have a keep uh them go tend to keep things to themselves you see me while many a bash her to my viewers and subscribers and i will tell her it's a lie i tell her it's a lie she tell let's not be too quick to judge you see me i say car you don't know the thing of my viewers and subscribers as me say people free for come cross come come to them things and more while worse if the person is a person in power or a person in authority that's what i say no jokes about it but nevertheless i'm just glad to see them all the nurse yeah. nurse assistant you can just imagine the amount of girl child and you see me i say pitney mollis while them day in them state upon the hospital bed you can imagine that no jokes about it my viewers and subscribers and i'm not like this earth you see me no jokes about it she was there because of molestation and then no this man yeah come try molest her while she was most vulnerable and as you said them man and already my viewers and subscribers you see me every day i say it sitting around with them man yeah. i swear to you in the hospital where the man for you take care of the people in pitney pitney this man i make in 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 hail i must in hail in hail get the best of my viewers and subscribers you see me i say the man start molly soft lick a picnic boy i may not even know i see it here my viewers and subscribers i see it no jokes about it this is money i want rapist no jokes and as i say proper investigation need to be done you see me i say put this money behind the bars you see me car you see me we can't have this money out in the public you see me this money is a threat to a young girl in the hospital you see me i say as a matter of fact i'm a threat to a female limp on a wall no jokes about it. I don't understand how all this can happen. 
You see me? At the same time, my viewers and subscribers, oh, a male for the pan female ward. Oh, the hell that happened. You see me? No jokes about it, man. It's rough. I don't know the thing of same viewers and subscribers. It's just my few cents, man. It matters still. You see me? It was sad for no see you're not even at the hospital. They look up in them, they are safe. You see me? Different is still more than one for your theme side of the story. Why am I for say? You see me? Why am verdict? Why am plea? You see me? I swear to you. As I said, let me know all the things in my viewers and subscribers. You don't know it's a boy Nagi, and I'm out. A Sean Stanley Zambia represent for Nagi Royal TV, you know, just in case you didn't know. Oh.